So, let us solve one more question. Let me read the question. Evaluate limit extends to infinity x square plus 5 x plus 2 divided by 2 x square minus 5 x plus 1. Here divide both numerator and denominator by x square. After that just substitute the limit. Then we get the answer. So, let us solve it now. Limit extends to infinity x square plus 5 x plus 2 divided by 2 x square minus 5 x plus 1 divide both numerator and denominator by x square. Okay. So, now we get limit extends to infinity x square plus 5 x plus 2 divided by x square and divided by 2 x square minus 5 x plus 1 by x square. Now, we can write limit x tends to infinity. Now, let us simplify the numerator. This can be simplified as x square by x square. You can check it also plus 5 x by x square. Next, what will be the next step? Plus 2 by x square divided by. So, let us simplify the denominator that will be 2 x square by x square and minus 5 x by x square next plus 1 by x square. So, let us simplify further limit x tends to infinity x square x square gets cancelled. What do you get it? Yes, 1 we will get plus 5 x by x square is 5 by x plus 2 by x square divided by 2 x square by x square is 2 minus this is 5 by x plus 1 by x square. See as x approaches to infinity the 1 by x, 1 by x square and 1 by x cube and so on approaches to 0. So, we can write that one. So, this fact has to be applied now. As x approaches to or extends to infinity the 1 by x and 1 by x square and 1 by x cube so on approaches to 0. That means, 5 by x is replaced by 0, 2 by x square is replaced by 0, 5 by x is replaced by 0 in the similar manner 1 by x is also replaced by 0. So, replacing the zeros, we will get the required limit now. So, this equal to 1 plus 0 plus 0 divided by 2 minus 0 plus 1 by x square tends to approaches to 0. So, 0. So, we have 1 by 2. This is the required limit. So, let us solve one more problem. So, because this problem is very, very important problem. So, most of the time this question may be asked academic as well as in competitive entrance examination also. So, let us solve this problem just simple by rationalizing the numerator itself only. So, let us rationalize 
and solve this problem. limit x tends to infinity root of x square plus x minus x okay multiply both numerator and denominator with root of x square plus x plus x. So that we can write this one now. Limit x tends to infinity root of x square plus x minus x or convenience by one write on multiplied with root of x square plus x plus x divided by root of x square plus x plus x root of x square plus x plus x. So now just observe the numerator if you say this is a this is b a b a minus b into a plus b is nothing but a square minus b square. So, in that manner we can simplify using a minus b into a plus b. So, let us simplify. So, like this limit x tends to infinity. So, what do we write? Root of x square plus x whole square a square minus b square that is x square divided by root of x square plus x plus x into 1 root of x square plus x plus 1 we will get it. So, let it be simplified now. So, now this equal to limit x tends to infinity. So, this can be written x square plus x minus x square am I correct? The numerator can be simplified like this. So, divided by we have root of x square plus x plus x x square x square gets cancelled. We have limit x tends to infinity x by root of x square plus x plus x. So, now we need to take common x from the denominator then x x gets cancelled. So, that it becomes very easy to replace the limit. So, now here we can follow this strategy limit x tends to infinity x by root of here take out uh, x square common we get 1 plus x by x square am I correct? If you multiply once again x square plus x only will get it plus x x by x square is equal to 1 by x. So, now this can be rewritten as limit x tends to infinity ok you can check x by it is very interesting root of x square is x am I correct x times root of 1 plus 1 by x because x by x do not get any confusion x by x square is 1 by x am I correct plus x. Now, from these two terms let us take x common limit x approaches to or x tends to infinity x by this x is common these two. So, we have root of 1 plus 1 by x plus 1 see very interesting. Now, x x can be gets cancelled we have. So, limit 
x tends to infinity 1 by root of 1 plus 1 by x plus 1. As x approaches to infinity, the 1 by x approaches to 0. So, that is why as x approaches to or x tends to infinity, this 1 by x tends to 0. Now, replace 1 by x is 0, we get required limit. So, this equals to 1 by root 1 plus 0 plus 1. This is 1 by root 1 plus 0 is root 1. What is the value of root 1? Yes, 1. So, you get 1 plus 1 whose value equal to 1 divided by 2. So, this is the answer.